Hello, and welcome back to Pathfinder Wrath of the Righteous. So, last time we, uh, maybe looted a little bit too much and maybe put the lives of our army at risk. Yeah, something like that, Lord Morale, all of that kind of nonsense. Um, apparently the loot would have disappeared, by the way, if we just killed the thing first, so it's good that we got it. And this time, we are now, uh, trying to find a path through underground, I think? It, it didn't really explain, but I assume that's what we're doing. Oh no. I thought we were done with it. There's more of these things. All right, Lan, kill it. Can you retreat already? I mean, that was damage at least. Good job. Um, hit it. I'll take our surprise round if nothing else. We can't charge, really. Okay. Um, here then. That's fine. Then you'll shoot it. Darren, shoot it. Land. The wrong okay, um, more of this. Okay, didn't overcome the spell resistance. One of those. Okay, and then we'll move, like, over this way. Sila, can you charge now? You can, perfect. Oh, I was gonna say, like, where's our horse's turn? The, the horse can't be with us anymore. I forgot. I will see the horse that was eyes. really good at killing the swarms can't be with us. Well, on me. the positive side, Big Lan is still pretty good at killing the swarm. Alright, there we go. Some of that. And the loot. Ooh, bloodstained letter. Let's have a look at that. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's not have a look at that. Let's have a look at that in the pause menu so that we're not using Lan's uh, buff timer while we're uh, doing that. That makes a lot more sense. There we go. There's a letter on one side of the paper and on the other a hastily drawn map of the dungeons with a mark in one spot. To anyone who can help us, my name is Harkel. I'm a chief of the Nasty Waifs gang. Recently, we raided the Tower of Estrod in Canabris. Really? Interesting. Okay. And with Norgorber's blessing, we took quite a haul. We hid in a reliable place with bad reputation, somewhere the law would never think of going. We are celebrating our success when Quick Rick appeared and choked two of our friends to death. We knew things were bad because Quick Rick had already been dead for about four hours. The old man was a drunk and his heart had failed on the steep mountain roads. Terrified, we chopped Quick Rick into pieces, but a few hours later he came for us again and he brought with him the two he killed earlier. That's when the real nightmare began. Something so bad the mind can't take it. Corpses came back to life howling, screaming in pain and rage and killing. The way they killed. Even now we're sitting in a cave, keeping a wall of fire burning with oil sanctified by the priests of Iomade. It's the only thing separating us from the mob of walking corpses we once called friends. Praise Norgorber. Uh, we took an oil vessel with us from the Tower of Estrod. It won't last another day if the heat doesn't kill us uh, quicker. Looks like the nasty waifs are done, so here's our offer. If you can get to Dry River Canyon and get us out of here, we'll honestly return all the loot, show you all our hiding spots, empty our pockets, confess to everything and accept any punishment except for the gallows. If you want, we'll even sign up to be crusaders. We'd rather die in the mouth of a demon and suffer here forever with our friends. Ah, <sighs> I know my comrades well. And the man who planted this letter for you will have long ago escaped to the south. I beg you. Here's the exact location of the place where the nasty waifs are making their final stand. If you have a drop of mercy in you, uh, save our souls. Harkel, honest thief and chosen ch uh, chief of the nasty waifs. Interesting. Okay. Well, did that actually give us a location or is that... No. Okay, so... It didn't unlock a location on the main world, so it must be somewhere down here, maybe? A boulder covering a secret tunnel. It's not that secret, if we can just see it. Uh, okay. Are these the nasty waves, I assume? <laughs> Kill them. That was good. Now, how much damage was that, actually? Oh, about half of its health. Okay, it died and then exploded. Nice. Charge. Uh, you can't do anything. That's okay. We'll move you forward. Take a shot. Perfect. Alright. Easy enough. Things that aren't swarms, easy to kill. 
something. Yeah, you did. All right. Who? Me? Yeah, Gosh, just stealth up because I don't trust the game at all. Something Move past wrong. the trap. Disable it. This is my kind of work. Okay, everyone. Reveal. Let us be off. Get back in formation. Let's go. Do another quick save. Hello. Uh, Lan? Big Lan? They will break ah, it hurts. Ourselves. Kill. Kill. Tear. Okay. Is dead. I suppose if I wanted to skip time, I could just do this, right? Yeah, and then go back into turn base mode. That kind of works. Yeah, I like that. We should do that more often. You can't charge. That's okay. Move forward and one of those. A little dazzle. Charge. It's a Cairn White. Okay, uh, shoot it. Should have listened to reason. All right, it's going for Sela. Needs a 20 to actually hit, so it didn't. How long have we got left on that? Two minutes. Oh well. Big, big land still doing uh, good work. Even if he's not around for very long. Um, if we walk across this, we can, but it's probably going to be difficult terrain, right? If we actually Let's end up move. fighting. Well, that's the edge of the world, I see. Um, rearrange yourselves here. Lan. Shoot. Make every strike count. Why? Why is this happening to me? Yes, yeah, so this must be the remains of the the people whose letter we just found. You're irrelevant. Shoot it. Cross the wrong mongrel. Uh, one of those. You're probably not going to get in range. That's fine. Charge. Okay. Nothing here. Um, this is a big area. Okay. Uh, stop. Follow me. Lan, shoot it. You won't survive me. My soul is rotting. Wait it's riddled her. with worms and bugs. Well, that one's dead. Charge. Okay, there's a few over here. Uh, hit it. Nice sneak attack. Precision and yeah, grace. just move closer, I guess. Sila, move out. Let's just get closer to hitting these ones. Kill it. Uh, again, move out. No, keep going. Yeah, there's more over here. That's what I was worried about. Hit it. Oh, guess he just didn't do anything on his turn. That's fine. Minus one level. Oh. I hate the negative levels. They're so difficult to get rid of. My Although, wait, did muscle. I not buy um, the ability to fix that last time? That last time it happened, I'm like, this is really I'll annoying and then bought the uh, potions. Maybe. Charge. Shoot. Come on. <laughs> really? Uh, the misses were fairly bad there. Hit him. Nice damage. Okay, shoot him. Nice crit. Alright, move closer. Okay, Sila. The inheritor. Guide my blade. Gonna move Lan a little bit closer and then shoot him. Endure this. The air we spread. Good. Turn around. Wolgif. Very well done. Out of my sight. Okay, it gets a turn. At least we didn't lose another level. Dead. Uh, did I bring along potions that will get rid of your uh, problem? Restoration lesser. Uh, no, I didn't bring along a potion. Did I bring along one of these? Remove disease, remove sickness, restoration, there we go. Um, just checking. Also, yeah, brings back neg to levels, cool, use. Right, that solved that problem. Right, loot, nothing. This loot, we'll have it. 
That was a uh, glitter dust, I think. Belt of incredible decks, not for um, our archer friend. Uh, he's all about the wisdom. This is actually for you. You already have a belt of incredible decks. Okay. Uh, I mean, it would be fine for either of you for just now. I mean, the dex isn't bad on him. It's just that it's not going to be great. I mean, if his size goes back to normal, uh, I guess I'll be fine. It's not ideal on him. We can give it to somebody else when we get back to camp. But right now, it would actually give him a buff when he gets smaller. Wand of Zacharias. Oh, okay. So it is the things from the museum. Now, we were told something about this wand. Like, it has to go back to somebody. Um, I will see in the whirlwind, I think. From memory. Nice damage. Okay. Um, move forward. Shoot it. I'll do it. Just run forward as far as you can. Uh, can you charge? No. Alright, run forward as far as you can. Uh, same here, basically. Darren. Precision and great. Nice crit. Oh, there's another uh, white. Uh, now, it's still flat-footed, so we could still charge and maybe kill it. We can't, but Cover we could walk up right? and maybe kill it. Perfect. Shoot it. Nice. More coming out of the water, but we already got the... Oh, there's Garkle, the person... Did he write the letter? Uh, I thought it was Harkle who wrote the letter. Um... It was Harkle. That's Garkle. Are Garkle and Harkle the same person? I'll remove this obstacle. Uh, I would suspect yes. What is Freebooter's Bane? Oh, wait, sorry, that's a class that we've got, uh, that we saw. I think it was... I don't know which class it was. Maybe Ranger? Oh, wait, you know what I could do? It was Ranger. There you go. That's what Freebooter's uh, Bane is. Okay. I think it's like Hunter's Mark. Something similar to that. Or at least in concept. Hit this thing. Okay. Um, I should always use this. So not using it is just silly. Turn on... We won't uh, yeah, defensive maneuvers. Attack. That gives us a lot of AC. I'll Shoot make it. Short work of this. Um, can you charge over here? No. Okay. This is broken slightly. There we go. Right. Uh, charge? No. Okay. Attack. Zap you or zap you. Why not both? Nice. Move a little bit closer. Uh, only has 41 seconds Victory. left on that one. And... Perfect. Okay. Move up. And maybe some magic missiles. Nice. At least we did some damage. Please stop taking levels off me with your sword. This guy evil, by the way? Yeah, a little bit evil. Alright. Um, I don't know what we want to be doing here. Uh, let's take a step back. And then maybe go for protection from evil. I don't know how difficult he's going to be, so we'll just do that for just now. And then maybe drink a potion. Yeah, like one of these potions will probably do. Yeah, uh, where are we? Backpack. Drink it. Okay, that was really quite disappointing, but that's okay. Um, shoot him. Wolgif? Okay, he's not that strong. Reasonably strong, but not that strong. Um, one of those. Then take a step back, just so he needs to take a tax of opportunity if he goes for us. Uh, that's horrible. The double level down and knocking her down. It's just severely not okay. Darren? Move closer, and then I would have used this, but I have no actions left to use that in, apparently. Oh, I, I did a full move action, apparently. Okay, I don't know what he did, but whatever he did was bad. Nice sneak attack damage. Killed him. Right. 
Uh, Darkle had nothing on him. Uh, we need to use this. So let's go with a sc scroll of restoration. Followed by going over here. Come on. Double levels back. Perfect. Right. Uh, then we probably want to heal a little bit. Stand. I think I'm just going to spam these to heal. Because they're probably not going to be that much uh, use going further into the game. And it reduces the weight that we're carrying. So we can carry more loot. Right. Some more of this. Yep. Perfect. Uh, followed by... What? Stranger! Kill the stranger! Let her suffer with us! They're all back up again! And you lowered Nanio's level! Uh, kill him. Okay. Some of them are back up again? What? Uh... Did not see this coming, if I'm honest. Maybe I need to pick up the wands. I think I might need to pick up the wands. Right, back off. One of those. Sparkle's back up as well. Uh, <laughs> oh. Pick up the wands. As soon as your fingers touch the wand, a surge of energy courses through your body. A howling choir of restless souls deafens your very thoughts. Green light pours from your eyes. It can rend soul from body if you so much as will it. The wand vibrates in your hand, like it's alive, but no, it is certainly not, as you realize with amazing clarity. There's definitely something inside, and it's studying you closely. Reach out your mind and touch the power that ha that's hiding within the wand. Your hand clenches the wand harder and harder like it's closing around the throat of an enemy. Suddenly the darkness lurking within the wand emerges and seizes your hand. It crawls through your eyes and deep into your mind. A spark flares in the darkness. It's a firefly, held gently in the hands of a young mage. Its light barely diminishes the gloom. But it's enough to see the stone walls of a dungeon. There are several others, young and battered wizard crusaders, holding magic wands, all showing signs of recent battle. You hear a rumble from above, followed by a furious demon shriek. The mages rise, preparing for another fight. A tall figure arises before them. Master Zacharias, you're alive! The mage towering over his apprentice is pale. His clothes are covered in blood, his voice is dull and dispassionate. The newfound sanctuary has fallen. You have fulfilled your duty. Now leave. It's, this is my battle, not yours, Telden. Telden is the person from the museum, the apprentice, right? Yes, we met Telden, the local museum creator. The apprentices, baffled, turn around to the young man holding the firefly. Today I die and leave my friends. Take my wand and deliver it to Canabras. In the hour of greatest need, let a worthy crusader return it to me. I will know that my brothers need me, and I will rise to their aid. Even death will not stand in my way. So I can set free the horrifying thing inside the wand, break the ominous item, or hide the wand in the bag. Hide the wand in the bag because we need to take it back to Master Zacharias? Let's go. The green light fades as quickly as it arose. The choir of the dead quiets uh, their howls. The power slips away, even as part of your body protests against it. You vividly realize how fragile and fickle mortal flesh is. All right, we then got a hit. One of those, please. Um, and run. <laughs> cool. Well, now we have to defeat them all. Yeah, okay. Um, maybe one of these? Thinking one of those could be good. Just damage to everything. That'll definitely work with Lan if Lan can get a turn. And then maybe smite evil. Okay, let's go with that. Uh, I hate this fight, by the way, from our side. Like, it, the, the negatives are so big, as in the chances of us just, um, 
like losing so many levels potentially, well at least until we buy more restoration scrolls, is huge. Um, shoot Garkle. You failed. I mean, you were probably going to fail against most people. At least if you hit, it would have been amazing. Alright, take a step back. You're pretty low on health. Let's start with you. You won't survive me. Look at the spread. That's what I was looking for. Okay. Distract them from me. That one's down. Nenio, step back. And let's give us a little haste. Okay. Garkle just crit Sela for 40. Kill Garkle. No. Okay. This condition is irrational. Uh okay, Sela. A little self lay on hands. We'll put on defensive maneuvers and then you know what? One of these. Just realize we don't really need defensive maneuvers if I'm doing that, but that's okay. As it doesn't actually apply, but that's alright. Uh that one? I or health one? Okay. Hey, we at least uh got it down a bit. Come on. You only had to roll a five. You failed so many times in a row. Uh okay. Get it. Nice. Nenio. Back off. Snowball. Snowball. There we go. Nope. Nice misses. Okay. Um, we would take an attack of opportunity if I tried to do that. Hit it. Went for Wolgif, who's now lost a level. The light. Take you. Okay. Shoot it. Precision and grace. Kill it. Got him. Okay, a lot of levels down. Not a huge fan of that. Take the armor off, or take the weapon off a of Garkle before he can do anything else. All right. Vermin Bane Elven Curve Blade plus two. What is Vermin uh, Bane? Excels against certain foes. Oh, against Vermin. I see. Interesting. Charcoal suit and the remains of greasy looking liquid, possibly traces of burnt oil. A massive claw, judging by its size and color, it once belonged to a silver dragon. We have a piece of Terendalev's claw. Okay, so I believe that we can take that to the storyteller. Now, we don't have a quest to take that to the storyteller, but um, in a different uh, playthrough, I did get a quest to take that to the storyteller based on other stuff that we did. So. I'm wondering whether that we can still do it now. I assume that we can. Um, helmet of uh, Scroica. Judging by its adornments, this massive knight's helmet once belonged to a hell knight. There's a dent from a powerful blow on the bottom of the rear plate. Oh, cool. Uh, I just realized that Lan is now back to his normal size, so he's working off of decks for uh, his two hit now. Ooh, a book. The Crusades are seen by ordinary folk. Um, I don't know if we've read that one, but it doesn't seem extremely necessary. Vessel of Raelus. Um, the copper vessel is empty, but there's a film of scented oil along the sides. The outside of the vessel is covered in engravings praising Iomedy. Oh, while I'm here as well, um, where are we? The wand? Yeah. Well, I guess we just need to find Zacharias for that one, really. Curse Pilaf. It's another dish. Cool. Loot taken by the thieves from the Tower of Estrod. Anything here? Not nah, just generic garbage loot. Anything Can't further back? Me. Ooh, what have we got? Is that a special rapier? It is a mind piercer. Uh, plus two cold iron rapier deals an additional 1d6 piercing damage against enemies who are under mind affecting um, effects. Nice. Well, it's a camellia item, I assume. So I assume you're meant to use a hex and then get the bonus with it. Onwards. All right, nothing along there. That is correct. Okay. Anything out in the sea? I assume not. It's probably a river, not a sea, but that's okay. Let us be off. Yeah, that was a spawn zone. 
yeah, I think we got everything. Good. If we didn't, then we should be able to come. It should just appear at the end. Right. How many negative levels do we have? I know, Nenio, you're missing a few. Three. One. One. Two. Okay. Uh, let's sort and by type. How many of these do I have left? Uh, three. Okay. So one, two, three, four. So I have four people who need this. Let's give one to uh, you. Because you really needed it. You also really need it. And then I think Seal is the one who needs it the most out of us two. Does that make sense? Right. Missed me already. Uh, we are running out of heals, but that's Rely okay. On me. Uh, you can have some more of these. There we go. Something like that. Nanio, have some heals. Cool. And then um, a bright future awaits. Where where are we? Darren? Smile. Not Darren. The us. Not One of those. Just yet. I forgot. He's no longer big, so he no longer gets hit by our air we. That's fine. Right. So we've now discovered this. That must have been Harkle. I don't know whether naming him to Garkle was deliberate or not, but there we have it. Right, and we get out this way. So now we want to head along to the left, which is the, I assume, the way we were meant to go. Ooh, uh, just a sword sitting there. Not at all bait. Uh, doesn't seem like it was bait. It's just a long sword plus two. Um, that is better than this sword right now. Technically, right? Uh, that is indeed just better than the one that you're using. Now, the problem is, obviously, it's not cold iron and it's not good aligned, but it is just better. So, we'll, we'll go with that. Uh, and we can always put Radiance back on once we've uh, improved it, because we know there are improvements to do to it. Right, continue moving forward. Swarm, huh? Hmm? Shoot it. Alright, I need more damage. That's pretty good. We'll move forward a little bit. There are two swarms. Good to know. Try and get that to fix itself. There we go. Work of this. Um, magic. Alright. We knew we weren't really in range for that. Get along to the edge. And he'll shoot it. Um, I don't really want to go too close to it right now. Uh, I'm actually going to delay my turn till here. Yeah, till after they've had a turn. Darren. Out of my sight. Okay, Endure shoot it. This. Magic. Okay. Chill. There are three swarms. Uh, shoot it. Mind over muscle. You're moving closer. All right, they're all the way in now. We Kill it. Falter. Okay, Darren. Not quite. Lance just attacking the one that's on him. That's fine. If you're gonna break, at least break in a useful way. Unlike uh, Wolgif there. All right, uh, Nenio. Uh, nope. Nope, it's tempting, but no. Uh, let's see here. Shoot this one. To reason. No, I was just trying to remove it, basically. Oh, and one of those. Darren's just taking shots. Lan's taking shots at the one that's on him. Make every he decided we need to make one attack this time. Good job, Wolja. Time to share your treasures. Uh, Sila? Nope. Went back over here. That's okay. Okay. Darren actually managed to shoot it. Lan. Very nice. Okay. Attack. Moves back over to Lan. We got two attacks of opportunity on it while that was uh, doing its thing. 
Okay, shoot it. Lan. You've crossed the wrong mongrel. Almost. Good job, broken wool jiff. Right. Uh, we'll do a little heal here. Another heal. Another heal. We're almost out of potions, but that's okay. It's only because they don't heal very much. Right. Forward. Faced with two paths, we took the right path. Which it might be trapped. Ooh. Might I'm assuming treasure. the right path the wrong path just because of how it's set out, but maybe I'm wrong here. Is there any way past this? I'm here. Let me pause. Where else would I be? There is no real way past this. Okay, never mind. Let's head back. Maybe the two paths join up at the top, but uh, right now we can't walk past that trap. So let's go. Um. Wait. Onwards. We can assume that there's a swarm with it. Land, take a shot. Did I actually get my shot off in time? Don't think I did. Okay, uh, shoot it. There is a swarm with it. It was a good assumption to make. And there are more swarms. Uh, okay. On the positive side, Nenio has good uh, initiative. Darren? Shoot him. This is fine. Oh, there's more swarms, huh? Oh, okay. No, no, no big deal. Um, that will only... De are these guys undead? No, they're just chaotic outsiders. Uh, hit it. Into the fray. Okay, this is a fireball situation. Okay, that's fine. It sounded like I did damage to Sela there. Uh, I'm gonna just ignore that. Yeah, a little damage to Sela. Thought I'd positioned it well. I had not. All right. Okay. This is fine. Uh, shoot it. I will see to your demise. All right. I love the way it moves back and forward just to hit you with the debuff. That Sela. I mean... Okay. Sorry, Sela. I need to do it, because otherwise we're never going to be able to kill them all. Alright. He's alive. Or just now. Uh, step back. Shoot the guard. Alright. Yeah, okay. Lan, please. Lan, I need your attacks per turn. Self-heal. Alright, Nenio. One of those. Okay, at least I killed that guy and then I can move out of the way. Tactical retreat. No. Okay, we're all pretty low in health. Uh, that one. I'll make short work of this. At least we hit it. Someone's decided it's gonna sit on Nanio. All right, kill it. This. And another one. Nice. Okay. One of those. Really hoping that was the end of it. Okay, kill it. Oh, I can activate the healing, we at least, if it. nothing else. One HP. I'm wounded. We're down. Okay, kill Make it. Every strike count. Oh. Let us be on. All right, so relatively tough, I would say. <laughs> Quick save. Where is the way out of here? 
Ooh, loot. Alright, got Let's that. Move. We got an athletics check over there. Which will no doubt lead us into a fight. Any Whoa, no, no, no! What is this? <laughs> okay. Oh, you were confused as well. Perfect. So not only did we just walk around the corner into a huge thing. I was kind of hoping we were nearing the end. So I was like, maybe I can save off healing. But uh, we walked into this thing. Kill it. It it saved its will save. But, you know, it was close. <laughs> uh, yeah, it was, it was about a 50-50 once I got through the... Uh, Spell resistance. Oh, there are two of them. Okay. Heal. Um, protection from evil, I guess. Then probably a heal of some kind would not go amiss. Right. Sila, self heal. Hit it. Well, that's not good. Does that stack? You not at all. Wrong well, I probably should have just done two and checked. I was like, maybe I can do ten attacks. That is not the case. Yeah, there's no way for us to cast that, unfortunately. How about Grease? We could cast Grease, no problem. Okay, they succeeded in their will uh, saving throw, but at least they had to make one. Uh, What's this, Displacement? Oh, we can use that to give us another thing. Oh yeah, let's use our Bonded Object. Yeah, which now gives us a Haste, which we can now use. Nice. Okay, seems good. Shoot. I will see to your demise. Okay, pass the the uh, saving throw. All right, little heal up. Um, suppose we could try this. Fail to overcome spell resistance. Well, not great. Uh, wait, was that only a swift action? It was only a swift action. Oh, cool. Move one of those, and then we'll just uh, go stand near, I guess. Yeah, we'll go stand over What's here. That? That's okay. Tila. Uh, I probably should have done this on the last turn as well for um, for us, but that's okay. Heal. Just wait. Can I get it to actually show attack, or is there a reason why we can't attack right now? Shouldn't be a reason. Let me just try it. There we go. It's just not showing up with the uh, option. That's fine. Hit it. Alright. Uh, I should probably be healing him as well. One of those. Followed by one of these. Okay. It did some damage. They have damage resistance. Oh, against cold acid and fire and exceptions for good. Uh, which I think we have the... We should have the buff on. The holy symbol. Yep. Okay. Um, let's see what else we've got here. Greater invisibility. Displacement. Good for for a... Blinding ray. Uh, which would dazzle them, maybe. Alright, ear piercing scream. Alright, four damage. At least it wasn't reduced, I guess. Precision and grace. That's fine. Okay. Uh, mostly misses. Uh, there is a bit of con damage that has been done to her or whatever. So her con's starting to drop. Um, let's see here. Well, I guess I'm going to attack. Forward! Good. Well done. Uh, definitely go for a heal here. Then attack. Okay. Shoot it. 
You won't survive me. And okay, that's fine. I'm actually thinking healing him is probably not worth it just because uh, he shouldn't, in theory, be in range. Scorching Ray. It's probably going to reduce the damage, but all right, I only did two damage anyway. It's fine. Um, hmm. Maybe just try this again. Okay, it saved its fortitude saving throw. I'll make short work of this. All right. Well, it's annoying. They used a poison that does con damage. Okay. She is severely dying. Lots of misses. Oh, he, he didn't get a turn, I guess. Oh, yeah, it skipped a bunch of turns. That must have been the other effect of what they were doing to us. Probably wouldn't have been too bad if it here before this fight, to be honest. She's dead. Oh, because her con dropped to zero and now we're dead. Okay. Load last save. Let's try uh, healing. That'll be a good trick. I might try a rest. Yeah, it might be time to do this. I know there are enemies just around the corner, but <laughs> seems like the right time to rest. We're only going to do one. Uh, let's go. I know you're a paladin and all, but, but just hear me out. We go into a tavern, you challenge the local champion to a drinking match, and I'll work my magic on the crowd to make them all bet on him. We'll split the takings 50-50. How about it? Drinking is fun, not work. I can't take money for that. Oh, so she do it for free? Hey, we didn't get to the first level of corruption. I'm still not entirely sure what it really does. Actually, I think it told us here. Arcane spell failure chance minus to wisdom, intelligence, and penalties to CMD and CMB. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. These are fairly bad if we hit them. Right. Morale went up by two. That's positive. And horse is back. Rules nice. All right. To be broken. Oh, look at that. So we've got an extra party member and... Yeah, we got an extra party member and we're full health and we have full spells. Let us be off. This should make this a very different fight, I imagine. Can we retreat already? I'm ready. Let's go. So, uh, Wooljif. Stab him. No, we'll stab him. Well, that didn't work quite the way I hoped it would. There we go, a little waggle of the stick. We have to turn that back on, but that's okay. Um, there's no way for you to attack this turn. Doesn't look like it. Okay, so maybe one of those. Follow the AI's um, lead and use that at this before we walk in, uh, in combat. It's okay. All right, I will use one of those. Then a perfect strike, then we'll shoot it. Okay, that was some damage. A uh, little smite evil. Charge. Okay, uh, haste. Another drone. We got well, will saves, which I think we passed. Cool. Right, uh. Bless. Guess it didn't hit everyone, but that's still fine. Horse. Attack this one. Ooh, that's a lot of sneak attack damage. That was, uh, what, 50 damage in one turn? That's pretty nice. It minus his con, and he's dead. <laughs> that's less nice, I would say. Do we have a scroll of res on us? If we don't, then we have to reload. Uh, we don't. Okay, cool. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay. Um, the instant killing our party members is a bit of a problem. I'm guessing it instant killed them because the con went too low, but I might be wrong. Wait, where are we going? Over Let here. That was actually worse than last time when we had... Um, like, I don't actually understand how it could be worse when we had, you know, no HP last time, but there we go. Land, oh, shoot it. Yet another oh, it passed its perception check to see us, but I guess we're closer this time. 
Uh, one of those. One of those. Hit it. The wrong oh, it's all reduced because we're not good lined, but that's okay. Uh, we'll become good lined further into the combat. Yo, some haste. He moves forward. Tila. Smite it. Charge. Failed because of uh, uh, because we were um. Cover me, all right? Yeah, fa failed because the horse was in the way, basically. Um, one of these that will hit everybody this time. Yeah, that's fine. That's now on. Um, no, let's use the tankard. I've never used it. Oh, uh, that's amazing. Okay, good, good to know. Forwards. Uh, this thing's insane. Okay, I definitely should have um, brought it in earlier. Also, should have used my uh, judgment. I'm aware. Step out here, attack. Nice. Uh, which one do I help with? I guess this one. You won't survive me. Okay, uh, shoot it. Mind over muscle. Perfect misses. Love it. Right, hit it. Stabby now we can hit you. it with the uh, Wolgif. For a ton of damage, including a crit. Sight. It's down. Second shot missed. It's our Zata's turn. Also missed most of its shots. With all your might. Horse. Did the horse get poisoned? I think the horse might have got poisoned. You should have listened to reason. Keep shooting it. Into the fray. Nice sneak attack damage. Did the horse get poisoned? It did. Okay. Uh, where are we? Us. Affliction. Horse. Failed to dispel. Oh, so I need something that can dispel poison. Smile. Wait, we have that, don't we? Just yet. Uh, no, we don't. Do you have that? You do, right? To be broken. Neutralize poison. So that should now have neutralized it. Yeah. So now it's just the con damage, which is okay. How much con damage did you take? One. That's not too bad. It didn't even remove a bonus. Yeah, okay. So we can now remove that trap from this side. Is it gone? Whoa, wait a second. I was going to say, is it gone? It wasn't gone, but that's okay. We disabled it the old fashioned way. This is my kind of work. Yeah, so this is the right hand side, right? Oh, right. No, I, I actually lost where we're going. They, okay. This was further in. I think we'll still be okay. Very good job, Wolgif. I will see to your demise. Endure this. At least we have horse back. Uh, although the horse is a little far away, but that's okay. It, it's very good at killing these things. Whoa, we have one of those as well. Okay, hit it. The light. Thank you. Hit the big guy, um, Nanio. I'm not really sure what to do with you right now. Could use another haste, I suppose. Uh, kill the swarm. Nope. Also didn't use my judgment. Fair enough. Darren. Uh, step out here. Shoot back in. Why? I dedicate my body to science. At least he did kill one of the swarms. In the end. Uh, wait, did he, it also got affected by the swarm? I love it. Right. Um, attack it. Nice. Nanio is down. Yeah, please don't kill Nanio. I wouldn't appreciate it. Make every strike count. All right, horse. Nope. Nice fortitude save. Why are you attacking the Minde? What what did they ever do to you? 
Should have activated the thing then. All right, good job. Distracted Attack for me. Heal. Okay. Land. Shoot it. You've crossed the wrong mark. Horse. That's fine. And then he was back up. Still a little bit lost in mind. You're now attacking Sela because Sela attacked Out you, of, of course. Uh, horse. Good job. Alright. I believe that my two tanks are attacking each other every turn now. Oh no, you decided to attack it. Come on. <laughs> Alright. No, don't. Why? He's like, first of all, I'm going to kill Nanio. Then I'm going to kill the guy who's attacking us. Got his priorities straight. Right, who has poison? You do. Right, remove affliction on yourself. Perfect. Anybody else got that poison on them? No. Okay. Fine. Right. Darren, I'm going to need some heals here. Well, Jeff, uh, what are you doing? Really? Really? All right, one of these. Heal. Uh, that should probably be fine, right? Yeah. Right, one of those. <sighs> so we're our, all right. So we're here. This is the room we just cleared, so we might as well have a look at it. The loot in this was a heavy mace, called the Voice of Hollow. Whenever the wielder of this plus two mithril heavy mace confirms a critical hit with it, a loud sound is produced. All enemies within a 30 foot uh, cone, except for the target, have to pass a will saving throw or be affected by voices of the hollow effect for 1d4 rounds. Every turn, the target is randomly affected by one of uh, the following. 50% chance they behave normally, but suffer a 2d6 sonic. Uh, oh, this must be what's been hitting us. 50% um, chance they attack the nearest creature. That could be what was hitting us. It's also mithril. Okay. Well, that's fine. What's this? And uh, the look of these plants, rapturous and sickly at the same time, suggests their unnatural origin. Okay. So we've been all the way down there, but have we been all the way down there? Right, we've been here, so then we come this way. And this brings us back to the, the fork in the road. Okay, so we've now been everywhere on this side. Right, so there's an athletics check there, which I assume will take us to the same place that this place takes us. Which is fine. Yeah, so it's like this is our next route, I think. Quick save. Let's go. No, so that takes us nowhere. Because there is nowhere to go from here. Okay. That's okay. Looks like there's some uh, elevation there as well. We know there's an athletics check there. So what is over here? Okay. Nothing, 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 nothing. My tail is twitching. Must be a sign. Uh I can't see what that's oh, it's connected to something over here. I see. Oh right, I see. Athletics check failed. How bad was it? DC 22? Alright, do it again. Uh. Alright, so let's also remove the trap. We would have to fight the Hunter Retriever, which is a level 15 construct. Anything else going on with it? Uh, it has evil... Uh, sorry, it has eye rays. I thought it said evil rays, but it has eye rays that can do things to us. Okay, uh, well, this is terrifying. Uh, Lan? I'm all ears. I see Nanyo. Buff Lan. Uh. 
Also, Nanyu, give me another one of those and give us a haste. Lan? Meditate on your mistakes. Shoots it. Might make you feel better. If we find trouble. Alright, we did 17 damage. Not bad. Okay, that was reasonable damage. We took about half of its HP off. I will see to your demise. Yeah, okay. I actually think we're gonna kill it in the surprise round. Or just afterwards. E either way is okay by me. Alright. Tila? Just get in there. Without risk. Uh, you're mostly okay now, Nenio. Just shoot it. You crit. Oh, ho, ho. lovely. Right. Um, one of those. Move in here. Shoot it. Killed it. Well, that wasn't too bad. Retriever's claw, a dagger. This plus two cold iron dagger has an increased critical multiplier of times three. Seems pretty good. Wolgif, wouldn't you say? Uh, so. This is pretty good for him. Uh, yeah, so it's better damage than the shiny dagger. So this is just straight up better than the shiny dagger. He has something else with daggers as well, doesn't he? This is plus seven. All right, let me. So is, the, so this is better than a shiny dagger. Is a shiny dagger better better than this one? Uh, eight to eleven is better. One d six plus one, one d six. So that is five to uh to twenty six. So that's five to twenty six overall in terms of damage. This one is 12 to 18. Wait, not 12 to 18, sorry. It's 9 to... Uh, it's 9 to 22. So 5 to 12... So this is a higher amount on the top end. The criticals are the same. I think this is better than that. That's, 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 that's my first call. Oh, this is now I do it. I think this is better. But now, if I go by type, uh, is this better than his retrieve? Is this better than the shiny dagger? Um, 3 to 13. It says it's 3 to 13, but it's quite clearly not 3 to. Wait, so that's 8 to 11. When equipped. Yeah, okay, but that's with a plus. That's with his dex plus. That's with his plus six from dex. Yeah, okay. So that's fine. So it's just damage plus dex. Oh, wait, is it already doing the calculation for me? It's already doing the piercing part for me. Oops, okay. So it's... Or is it... Wait. Am I being stupid? I am being stupid. It already includes the fire damage in its damage number. Okay. Uh, in which case... The shiny dagger is better. Be because its range of damage is slightly higher. Okay, he's just a dagger user now. I still think that this one is by far the best. 9 to 12, right? Yeah, 9 to 12 is the best. And it has a higher critical multiplier. Yeah, okay. <laughs> That's fine. Really wasn't that Mighty complex. Track. I was Mighty making it more complex than it needed to be. Loot. Amulet of Apothecary. Uh, plus one on saving throws. Oh, it's an amulet of natural armor with a plus one on saving throws against poison. Oh, uh, well, that'll be for us then. Where are we? This one? Followed by, like, I guess you can have the uh, amulet of natural armor. And there's our trap removal. Pretty good, aren't I? Yeah, so what's at the back here? Nothing? Oh, nothing. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> Just look at that. I didn't see this picture before. That is... That's March really cool. Alright. Back over here. So this must be the way out. Right now I've disabled the trap. You wouldn't give me one more fight, would you? Just let me leave. 
Right? No more swarms. Did we step on their toes as well? <laughs> Never mind. Oh, in fact, there's swarms behind us as well. Ah, it's actually a trap of swarms. So it's not just swarms, it's extra swarms. All right, well, uh, first couple stabs off. Shoot it. Uh, one of those while I remember. At least we get the surprise round somehow, despite us walking into the trap. Shoot it. Um, you can't charge it. You can't charge any of them. Okay. Make your way over here. Horse. I was hoping you could do damage. You did some damage. Okay. Uh, we'll just didn't do any. I'll remove this obstacle. Shoot it. I'll make short work of this. Now they're moving in. Yep. Uh, hit it. Nope. All right, land's already compromised. Oh, but he gets to use his turn. Okay, so hit it. You won't survive me. Didn't quite get a kill, so no AOE. The light take you. Horse is coming back over. It killed one. Shoot it. Oh, this one actually then. Yeah, okay. That's just annoying. Well done, Lan, and uh, doing a lot of damage. Into the fray. Okay, horse didn't do anything. Wolf didn't do anything. Shoot Mind it. Over muscle. Uh, oh, it looked like we actually got our melee attack as well there. That's cool. Okay. Well, at least we healed. Uh, Lan, you almost got it. This. I'm wounded. We are a little low in health, that is true. The inheritor, guide my blade. Nobody's doing anything. You should have listened to reason. Um a little bit over here and then heal. Very nice heal. Okay. Ah. Uh hit it. Won't falter. Good. Um Okay, they're both fairly low. How about this one first? Count. Just because the AOE will be nicer. Alright, hit it. Horse is doing its best. Wolgif. You actually hit the swarm. I was worried you were targeting Sela. Nice. I think I just freed Lan. Uh, you're nauseated, I think, so can't do anything. Shoot it. Crossed the wrong mongrel. Oh. Well, that's got to be it, right? A random last fight for us? Really? Well, I guess you'll heal yourself back up. Like one last trap before we leave. Forever. Onwards. Vrook, vrook. Okay. Lan. Shoot it. They will break against our Okay. Resolve. That was good. Very nice. Alright. Hit it. Reasonable. Charge. There are three of them, huh? Okay. Uh what are they? Acid, fire, cold. Okay. Uh, not really a lot that I can do right this second. I guess I just have to move closer. Your turn, Nenio. Can you charge? You could. Can you cast one of these? Uh, I think I want to cast, even though they're going to resist it, uh, I want to cast this one. Yeah, just so I do um, the sneak attack damage. Missed, and I only needed a two to hit. Perfect. Horse is in. Um, that's not a large enough radius for us to use it. There we go. Spores is annoying. 
Yeah, okay. A couple of our melees are out. Uh, I could do some summoning. Yeah. Let's maybe summon uh, 1d3 dogs over here. Just to provide things to hit it. Takes them a turn to activate, but that's okay. Move closer. Some of that. Some of that. Let's go. Tila can't have a turn. Uh, Nenio? Lightning bolt. Is immune to light. Oh, it's in the immunity section. I don't. I don't really like why it has the energy resistance nice and color coded, and then the immunities it has as words. I would prefer if that if they were done the same way. But that's okay. Um, you still flat footed? No. So I probably want to come in and actually hit you. If I could. So let's just get in. Time to share your treasures. Right, horse can't do anything, we can't do anything. Spores activates. Okay. Lots of mirror images. Move forward. Maybe one of those. Didn't quite get it. Dogs? Well, they didn't quite get it. Perfect strike, extra attack. Got it. Now we can get rid of some of the mirror images. Okay. Um, charge. The dog stopped us from moving, of course. You're irrelevant. Okay. A couple people are out. We're back. Uh, guess we could use that and then charge. Please don't kill my horse. Alright, move in. Heal. Okay. Dog. Just basically, the dogs are uh, going to try and get rid of the mirror images right now. Give ourselves an extra attack. Go for it. Okay. Mirror images are gone. Attack. Thank you! Uh, one of those. All of them failed to overcome the spell resistance. Wonderful. We're almost dead. Uh, hate that. Horse. Okay. One of our dogs is down. Heal. Um, yep, that'll do. Next dog is trying. Let's just get rid of the mirror images if we can. Into the fray. Uh, let's see here. Phantasmal killer. Ooh. It, it failed the will save, but passed the fortitude save on that one. But only just. Okay. Well, at least it did damage. Fine. Stab it. Horse. Keep up the damage on that target. We are going to take an attack opportunity if we stand up. I think it's time to just stay down for a turn. Spores killed our dog. Uh, you can't heal anymore. Maybe just a little bless. Okay. Move closer. Extra attacks. That one. I was just going for the one I thought might die first. Although this one looks like it has more of a chance now that Sila's back up. Uh, Phantasmal Killer. Once again, it's past its fortitude, but that's okay. Might as well try. Attack it. Ooh, nice. So we got the 40 uh, da we got 24 followed by a 40 crit followed by a 37 damage crit from Sila. Love it. We can now stand up. Maybe one of those. Nice. Shoot it. I will see to your demise. Move a little closer. 
Make Kill every it. strike count. Sila, you can charge. And and very dead. All right. Uh, can I remove spores? Uh, be halted by effects that remove or provide immunity to the disease. Uh, well, I think I have removed disease, right? One of these is removed disease. Sickness, disease. There we go. Did that remove spores? Yes. Okay, cool. Wait, are you spored up, Wolgif? You are indeed spored up. Uh, wait, that doesn't say any creature within range of the... 24 for X number of rounds. Yeah, okay, I'm just going to remove that. That's fine. Right. Vruk dealt one damage to us. Oh, we also have spores on. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I don't think we have any more removed disease, unfortunately. Do we have any potions of removed disease? Remove sickness. It specifically says disease, doesn't it? Yeah. Juice, feather step, light wounds. Uh, I don't think we have any. That's fine. Uh, none. Okay, that's fine, I guess. Uh, we'll just do this. Anybody have? Maybe you oh, have removed disease. Did I give fun. it to you? I removed sickness. You are my favorite. Aid. Not really what I'm looking for. I'm you sure you don't have removed yes. disease somewhere in your spellbook? Yeah, you're sure. You're sure. All right. Well, Missed I guess the best that we can do then is heal. Then every now and again, we're just going to take damage. Love that. Ooh, a radiant uh, cookery. Yeah, okay. Uh, what's radiant? It does divine damage, like 1d6, I think. Uh, let's have a look. Info 1d6 uh, positive energy damage on a successful hit. Oh, I thought that was a... Oh, that is not a uh, monk weapon. I don't even know why I have him with a melee weapon, given he doesn't need to use it. It's kind of just pointless. In fact, you know what? It is pointless. I will unequip it. That way he's using less... Or he has less stuff equipped. The touch of the abyss irreversibly changes the very lands of the world wound. Okay. I think this is lore for people who Let didn't read the off. lore. Um, I think that's what we're being given. How long have we got? Seven seconds. Okay. Uh, what else have we got in here? Nothing. Wait, is this... Was this in a whole... Was this whole area optional? Wait, no. Right? We should move. Uh, where are we meant to go? I thought this area was compulsory. Wait, we went all the way down there. Yeah, where, where do we need to go? This area was optional. Let's move. <laughs> this entire thing we just did was optional. Yeah, there's no progression. Unless I'm missing something obvious. Follow me. Oh, all right then. That would explain why there was no context for it. Yeah. It was just, there was no context for it because it didn't need context. It was, you know, just somewhere you could go. All right then. Well, that's fine. Uh, back over here. Let's follow our group along. We're almost at the exit. Right. Well, let's leave here. Definitely don't want to be here. Yeah, I'll take all the stuff. Why not? I'm probably going to rest the moment I leave. Ideally in a camp, so. Oh. The area exit was there. 
So that was all 100% optional. Nice. I'm happy we did it, but... <laughs> explains a lot about it. It was quite difficult. It was, like, completely unconnected. We had that guy saying, Oh, yeah, come and help us, you know, if, if you're... And I was like, well, it was the only path forward, but... The reason why it was kind of weird, it, going in there in the first place was the optional part. We also have very low morale. Okay, into our camp. Are we going to have to talk to people now? No. Okay. Do you have things to say? No. Okay, cool. Uh, let's have a look at our party. Yeah, that's that's the person I was looking for. Right, say goodbye to your belt. Hello, Regal. Say hello to your new belt. Which will now give you an even higher dex bonus. Hope you like it. Right. <sighs> you have anything new to say? I have the Keen Short Spear, which is significantly better than the ever-burning torch your character is equipped with. Uh, what do you mean the ever burn That is true, I do have the torch. You know what, I'll just unequip that. That'll help that tooltip never show up again. Onwards. Uh, blacksmith, hello. Okay, so, uh, now we can sell a bunch of stuff. Uh, don't sell radiance. Although, wait. Yeah, Radiance we were told to bring to um, the brother of the person who uh, betrayed us. Yeah, I actually don't know where we take Radiance. <laughs> That's a great question. Uh, which I hadn't thought of up until this point, is where do we take Radiance now that uh, the guy is no longer with us? As in, or the guy's brother it doesn't seem to be with us. Hmm, maybe there's a path where he can be Let with us, or maybe he joins us at like... A Dresden or something? Hmm. Hello. You okay? Just doing my little check-in. Uh, now, does this get removed by arrest? I don't think it does, right? No. Okay, how many people have negative levels? Is it just us? Uh, I think it's just us. Okay. Hi. Uh, you? Ooh, scroll of restoration. That's the one we're looking for. Scroll of restoration. Somewhere in here, restoration. Nah, it's a little bit much. I might buy 10. Deal. Cool. See you later. Let's move. Right, well. Uh, can we speak to Erebeth about, you know, leaving her to die? Do you think she cares? Didn't seem, seem awfully bothered. No? Can we speak to the queen about it? Because it did mention her in the uh, thing. Hello. Nope. I do quite like having this uh, button to remove uh, me. certain alignments. So we'll keep that for just now. Right. Uh, restoration. Use. Feeling much better. Commander's tent. Let's do a rest, shall we? Marshall. Oh, also drop off our uh, magical equipment. What's that one? Uh, keen composite longbow. Yeah, we'll drop. Oh, wait, I still have more stuff I hadn't. Uh, wait a second. I had more stuff that I needed to get rid of. I missed some of it. Alright, back outside. Blacksmith, I have more stuff for you. Onwards. Hello. Uh, the picks. The seven long swords. The very heavy armor. There we go. That's much better, right? Deal. Cool. Ooh, and while I'm at it, Camellia. I can I upgrade you to a new one of those? Uh, anybody else have an upgrade in this group? I guess, yeah, the spear might have been useful for you, I suppose. Oh, no, use glaives, not spears, of course. 
completely different. Uh, what's that? That's the short bow of code, which we don't really need anymore either. Can you use elven stuff? No. For some reason I thought that she could, but she can't. I think she might just be an elf, which isn't ne doesn't necessarily mean you can just use elven stuff. Um, you can't wear any armor. I was just checking whether anyone could wear that armor that we've got there before I put it away. No, I think we're good. Right. Back over here into the commander's tent. Now we can drop off all of our stuff. Just checking we didn't get anything else that was good there. Keen composite longbow, probably not. The claw of Jistka. Probably not for anyone. Yeah. I'm going to keep radiance on me just because I don't know what we're doing with that. But uh, that's fine. The rest of it can go. Uh, we had a book which we didn't read. Uh, we've read that one. Crusade is seen by ordinary folks. Read that one. Notes of a traveling priest of the coven. Uh, read that one. Letter to a noble crusader. I'm sure we've read that. That's elven notes. That's note written in handwriting. That's fine. We'll keep that on us. Uh, we had one more note, didn't we? Maybe not. I guess if I can't see it, we didn't have it. Okay, that's fine. Let us be off. Right, let us rest. Um. Oh, I can check our new recipe as well. Right, in there. Cool. So, cursed. Uh, so curse pilaf is Camellia's favorite dish, and it gives you a plus one to attack rolls for a day. That's really good. Yeah, I like that. Um, I just go with a hearty meal this time. Skill checks is generally okay. Right, let's go. You've got it all worked out. You go around in spiky looking, uh, spiky armor looking mean, then you can do whatever you want. That's the life. Wolgif speaking to Regil. Regil's reply. Astonishing. You are even more stupid than I thought, thief. Ooh, and that's it. Really? We're not getting any... Yeah, we didn't get any events or anything. Our morale even went up. Nice, well... We'll head outside. No events at all? Huh. I was sure we were going to get some sort of event for doing that. Uh, What about we go into here? You got anything to say? What's that? Ooh, what is that? Strange perfume. A small bottle with a unique scent. It smells of something sweet with occasional harsh notes like the air before the storm. Um. Oh, there we go. When we found a swarm of uh, viscavers, someone put a handkerchief soaked with pheromones in my pocket, uh, which attracted the insects. I found the vial of the same pheromones in your tent? The vial we just found, Nura? Nura's cheeks blush a little. That's my perfume. Perhaps it's strange to take perfume on a crusade, but you see, Knight Commander is a reminder of my mere normal, peaceful life when I go back after we've won. And besides, her cheeks blush even more and her voice drops to a whisper. The smell drives men insane. I have no idea how the smell affects infernal insects. I'm a historian, not a demonologist. Perhaps some malicious person used my perfume to lure Viscavers to you, but I swear it wasn't me. Maybe... Nura again lowers her voice to a whisper. Maybe one of my admirers is trying to hurt you and set me up. The uh, thing is more likely that you, with your uh, devil-worshipping ways, probably just backstabbed me. I think that seems much more likely to me. Just as a thought. But anyway, I guess you can stay in our party. Daniel's no longer a requirement for our party. Uh, I could bring Camellia back in, given where we're going. Like, I kind of want Camellia and Ember for where we're going, but it's still a little bit of, of a way away, but we could bring them in. You know what? Let's replace Nenio and Lan... Darren with Camellia and Ember. There we go. It's back to the old squad. 
Wait a second, I can't replace Darren? <laughs> Darren's the person whose house I'm going to and why I wanted to change the squad. Can I change party here? Uh, to take out Lan and bring in Darren? Yeah, okay, that's fine. <laughs> cool. I just wanted to see what we had going on around here. So we have a couple of demon armies that are fairly strong over this way, and then that's about it. We do any recruiting right now? Not really. Okay. Well, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to end the episode there. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.